Mike Bridge with TechCrunch, and it's day two of TechCrunch Disrupt New York. But here at, we're here in Red Hook in Brooklyn, in the beautiful Brooklyn cruise place. And uh, we're going to check out Startup Alley. Right, come with me. Right. I'm going to interrupt. I'm so sorry. Uh, right, Meg, experience Mellow. Did I just give you out of your fu star Series A funding? All right. Oh, really? Well, what is Meg? Meg is a, is a mobile first ad tech platform. We're on the build side of creating ads. It looks like this. It looks like this. Right? Looks, looks like this. <laughs> what does it do? So, as a brand or an agency or a media company or publisher, yes. you log in and use our platform to build your own ads in about 10 minutes. They're dynamic. This is useful. I need yeah. this. I need this. I need to build my Everybody own ad. Everybody needs this, I think. Marvelous. And, and is it super easy? Super easy. It's super easy. You can build an ad in 10 minutes. It's highly effective, outperforms other ads. You can launch it yourself. Incredible. And where do the, ad, where do the ads go? On the web or on, the, on mobile or what? Well, the ads go cross screen. They go anywhere. They're adaptive, so they go on web. They go in mobile. This looks super easy. Now, random stranger, do you like do you like this? I, I do like. Yes. Um, and what what do you find interesting about it? Um, I find interesting that anyone can use it. You don't need to be a designer to build an ad. Have you tried it yourself? I have tried it myself. What was the experience like? Very well. Marvelous. There you go, random stranger. Well done. Thank you very much, Meg. Okay. Oh, we yeah. go. Million. Million. Where's Million? Are you French? There it is. Not quite, no. <laughs> not quite. You in English? No, but yeah. What's that? You English? No, not not necessarily. Oh my God! It's such an international place. What is this? Is this yours? Yeah, it's ours actually, and uh, another partner is. And what is it? Well, basically, we're coming up with a marketing platform, mobile app um, marketing platform. So we uh, actually have a network of influencers that gets us like social reach. So social reach. Name me someone influential that you can reach. What's that? Name me someone influential that you can reach. Oh, that's this guy. <laughs> this guy. My own at Earth on Instagram. So we can use marketing channels like that to market different apps. So, for example, if you go in the App Store right now, actually, that's what I'm working on at the moment. I'm mocking this up. He's working. He's working. There's these startups. They never stop working, do they? I mean, we're the number one trending search in the App Store right now. For what? For our app called Game Switch. Game Switch. That's your thing. Correct. So if the internet's going to work here. And 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 did you do did you do that? Yes. Yeah, so beta is the development aspect of our company, and beta built it, and Million marketed it. I love that collaboration. Thank you very much, oh, Million and Beta. Now let's go over to here. What's this shuffle? Where's Shuffle? Hi. There you are. Right. Hi. Tell me all about Shuffle, sir. Shuffle. So we're Fuzzy Blend Games. We are officially launching Puxers, the fun brain game today. It is a unique blend of 2048 and. Uh, I do this. There you go. There you go. There you go. So the goal well, tell me what I'm doing. <laughs> you're making a ton of merges. So the goal of the game is to get the highest number possible by merging the same numbers, right? So you tap <laughs> to move this thing around. Yeah, exactly. See, yeah. how easy it is to get into. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is not hugely intuitive. <laughs> but you're making a lot of merges. There you go. So, uh, yeah, there you go. Tap. Win any points? You do. <laughs> Shuffle, right? What is it? What is it called again? Puxers. Puxers. Yes. Right, right. So, so by this, I prove my brain, do I? Yeah, you, you do. Um, so, it's. Uh... <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> anyway, right. Anyway, that's Puxers. Marvelous. All right, check it out. Uh, let's go over to here to um, Class Tag. Sorry, right. Class Tag. Hi there. What is it? Class Tag is uh, a platform that enables teachers to turn parents into partners. So regardless of socioeconomic Is it like a dating app or something? What's going on here? Uh, not exactly like a dating app. Um, Turning them into partners? I oh, know, I'm kidding. Okay, right, explain it. Okay, so parent engagement is uh, a better predictor of a child's success and um, uh, uh, in school than socioeconomic And at status. the moment, the teacher sends you some random email. You have no idea what's going on. And so what we do is we make it easy for teachers to turn parents into partners by giving them a uh, powerful to-do engine, goal-setting, uh, auto automated communications, really uh, up the signal to noise. And do the t who has to pay for this? How do you make money? We make our money from investors right now. Um, long term, our goal is to uh, do advertising and subscriptions. Um, but right now, what we're focused on is building our marketplace by doesn't, delighting. Doesn't teachers. that mean some strange organisation will be advertising to the media, to the parents, and to the ad to the teachers, or, or can they? They're free to ignore the adverts. They uh, they're free to ignore advertising. Absolutely. 
this is this sounds much more sophisticated. It sounds like a 21st century way of dealing with, you know, little Johnny's got detention and uh, and you have to ch chat to the teacher about it and uh, clip him around the ear. So marvelous. There we go. So that's uh, class tag. Class tag. Marvelous. What's going on over here? Bite snack. Hello. Hi, Anna Sophia with Bite Snack. Hello. Hello. Tell me what this is. Well, we're teaching kids uh, computer science as young as seven with artificial intelligence. Go on then. So we, it's going to adapt to the way a child learns. It's going to create a map of their understanding and build from there. Have you got a, a demonstration? No, I don't have a demonstration. But the format is going to be like a really cool storybook that adapts to the child's input. Yeah. And so, so where's the AI part of it? The AI is going to know what the child is, their current state of knowledge, and add information based right. on that knowledge okay. and it's going to test them without the kid knowing it's they're being tested oh marvelous so it's sort of stealth testing it's stealth testing marvelous. and uh, is it deployed now who's using it right now we are creating them mvp and we're looking for beta testers right and how do we get in touch with you bitenac.com or bitenac.com bitenac.com marvelous thank you so much right let's jump over here hello, hello. what is going? what is your name of your organization uh, the name of our organization is Greetable. Greetable. And we and are an online gift giving company. So the idea is that it's for when a greeting card isn't enough, but the alternative is 50 plus dollar flowers or browsing the internet endlessly. You need something for those smaller occasions when a friend gets a job. It needs to be. Happens personal. to me all the time. All the time. Yeah, all the time. All the time. Yes. It's, uh, it needs to be personal, it needs to be convenient to send, and it needs to be $10 to $30 in that price point. So the idea that we've created yeah. is a greeting card that folds up into a gift box. Oh gosh, brilliant. So, so I, I get this through the mail or something? Yeah, you get it through the mail. First, you're- Can you demonstrate while we, yeah, while we yeah, chat? Yeah, absolutely. Let's carry on. The Let's customer going. basically uh, adds their own photos and messages. Mm -hmm. They choose a gift to go inside. They're fun little gifts like candles, wine flavored lollipops, champagne flavored gummy bears. And then the greeting card actually folds up into a gift box, pairs the gift inside, and then we send it directly to the recipient all said and done for 10 to $30, but the recipient would never have to fold it themselves. This right. gets done by our manufacturers, so no worries. Just, just gets this in the mail. Uh, oh, they get this, and yeah. then they open it up, and oh my goodness, what a personal and gift. they are delighted. Fantastic. So you tested this with real human beings? Oh, absolutely. We just uh, we just launched in October. We're growing like 50% month to month. It's going very well. Uh, my name's Joe Fisher, by the way. This is co-founder Zoe Sharp. Hello, Joe and Zoe. And where did you get this idea from? And when, how did you come up with this idea? Yeah, so I was uh, I was going to a wedding, and uh, I usually give uh, give a. We all have to do this, right? I usually give a card. I just thought, you know, this friend is too good to get, just get a card, right? Yeah, we all yeah. we all like gifts better, so that's that's kind of where it came from. And what can it fit inside this? All kinds of things. So I'll I'll let Zoe. Uh, give, yeah. Yeah, give a couple what, what can fit inside? We're really specific about curating the gifts because our audience really cares about the maker movement. So right now we have 16 gifts. They're all things like wine-flavored lollipops or champagne-flavored gummy bears, some fun things like that. But eventually we're going to expand into other verticals like B2B, gifts for men, gifts for kids, gift cards. I love this because you're really tapping into the maker movement. Thank you very much. Greetable. That's fantastic. Well, that's a little bit of flavor of Startup Alley from Mike Butcher here in Startup Alley. Goodbye.